What's going on my team acne friends? Welcome to another acne video and the topic of this video has been requested so many times. This is how to shave your face when you have active acne. So this is gonna go for anybody with less severe acne all the way up to the crazy big cystic acne that I used to have because this is the exact method that I used when I'd have four or five cysts on my face and tons of whiteheads to minimize the damage while shaving. And I'd like to start this episode by saying every single person breaks out, man. A lot of you guys watch me because you know I I've cleared my skin up, I'm 100% clear and stuff, but I still break out. You will always still break out and don't be discouraged by that, be ready for it. It's not a big deal. So we're gonna go a close up on my zits in three, two, one. So these two little guys popped them on my face basically because we've been eating a little bit, you know, kind of loosely for the holidays, but they're a perfect example for showing you guys this technique for shaving. The most important thing about shaving, and it's so simple, is do not use razor blades. Use an electric shaver because razor blades, because they have no guard on them and they're just straight little like razor knives, all it's going to do is it's going to cut your cyst or your zits and your pimples off at the base of them. And so, so it's going to leave a very large large pock mark that's gonna be either bleeding or it's gonna scab up. It also leads to a, a lot more of a chance of it getting infected and getting into a bigger cyst formulating into something worse. When it comes to an electric shaver though, because it has a bit of a guard because it doesn't wanna nick you, right? It's perfect for all types of acne because as you go over a pimple, it will only, if it does even, cut the pimple open, it will only cut it at the very top instead of severing the bottom of it and causing, causing that huge, huge, huge bloody mark. It'll just pop the top. And sometimes if your acne is not so severe, it won't even pop the top of it. Just make sure you go nice and slow and don't use a lot of pressure. I think the problem with most people when they use an electric shaver because most people are inexperienced with it is they try to push really hard against their face and they try to get it all in one sweep. Usually electric shavers don't just take all the hair off in one sweep like a razor blade. It takes a little bit more time, but that's kind of the trade off. It's a little bit more safe for acne. Honestly, if I was gonna go purchase an electric shaver, I would even look for one that's a little bit less aggressive and takes more time because it's gonna give you more chance to not cut your face. So use a light pressure and go over the area three, four, five times and you know slowly take the hair off and try to be as light as you can on your acne as possible. This next tip I've said so many times and seriously it is everything. I know it's really hard not to touch your face but do not touch your face. When you're pulling your skin taut instead of touching your actual face grab from your neck and pull downwards to to tighten your skin because if you put your fingers right on your face you can be spreading so much bacteria you're probably gonna break out even more. And then once you're completely finished you've shaved up your face you're looking nice and clean cut you you've checked in the mirror for all the little stubble and stuff like that now you are done but most people will throw on aftershave at this point I don't think the aftershave is the best because it's gonna irritate your skin a lot at least for me it irritated my skin a ton and it made me break out more so instead I just immediately put my face under cold water and you really should do this don't not wash your face because if you have a little bit of like uh, those little pieces of hair that have shaved off but they're still on your face if you don't get those off theoretically they could actually cause big cysts by getting in to open pores. So just wash your face with cold water and then dab it with a clean towel or you can just let it air dry, which I think is like superb. That's the best way to do it. But that is it. That is all you need to do to shave your face. It's it's simple, but it, nobody really talks about it. And I feel like there needs to be a video, a video out there that kind of addresses it for us acne folks, because when I was shaving with acne, I did use a razor blade and my face would be bleeding literally all the way down my, my neck and stuff. And I would have to time my shaving to not be, you know, right before I went out, I'd have to do it in the morning if I was going to go out at night. So that I could let the scabs kind of heal up. So my friends, I hope that this video was helpful for you. If it is, please let me know in the comments below. And if you have any other ideas of acne videos you'd like me to cover, Accutane, anything, please let me know in the comments below. It's a great way to source ideas for me. If you enjoy this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. It helps us get this video out to more people who need the help. And subscribe if you're not subscribed already. Team Beyond the Week, CT. Lift heavy or die, Myron, motherfucker. Mm. Team Beyond the Week.